And what are your musical influences? Oh, well, um, to be honest, I, I grew up in the nightclub and entertainment industry. So um, for me, influences is where the entertainment and where the vibe and where extreme energy of uh, love and happiness, I would say. Oh, well, that's nice. That's, that's lovely, though. And what made you go into music? Well, um, to be honest, um, it was a quite um, sad story when I was young. Um, I had to choose music because uh, it was the best option that I had and I knew it, had, it was endless, you know. I was that type of kid, whatever I did, it had to be the best. Oh but, yeah. But then, but then when I got into the music industry, it's like so endless, it's like there's so much fight you have to put to be the best. I guess yeah. I got stuck and I keep fighting, still fighting, so. Oh, oh bless you, well done, carry on. Can you sing? I sing on my own, yeah, <laughs> when I'm in the kitchen, when I'm in the living room. And sometime at night I remember myself, I actually do, yeah, I do sing to myself. I, I wouldn't class myself a good singer. I mean, um, there's some of the songs that we, I've done and Ivan's done, we work together. And uh, there's some vocals that actually I've used mine. I do have, I do believe my vocal is a bit deep and, you know. I do shout around in the clubs when I play. I can't, um, especially when I have a few drinks, I have to take the mic and connect with the crowd and sometimes I end okay. up singing. And there's been a days really I have actually cut the music and sang a slow song. Oh, that's good. Oh, brilliant. Who is your favourite artist of all time? Oh, hard question. I don't know. Favourite artist? I have so many. That wouldn't be fair. Oh, right. Yeah. I mean, it's usually sort of top five. <laughs> oh, top five. Well, I mean, uh, well, David Guetta is really great. Yes. I, I, I love the way he worked and the, he, the dimension he have actually shown the industry, music industry. Most DJs would appreciate his work. Yeah. Um, I like Carl Cox, where he takes it to a next level of DJing and went hard with dance music. And. Yeah. Calvin Harris has been really great lately, you know. Oh, yes. I, I'll yeah. be honest, I, I really enjoy everybody who creates a good music, however they do it, whatever they get together and give us these sounds, they enjoy our lives, I would say definitely they are my favourite artists. Yeah, 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 I, I like that. Do you write songs at all? Yeah, actually, we do. I mean, we've been working, writing some lyrics with Ivan lately, and we are actually looking for some vocals who can sign them, you know, we don't trust our vocals. Oh, yeah. God bless you. <laughs> yeah. I'm, sure, I'm sure you'll find you'll find yes. some of it. And you create your own mixes of music. Definitely, yes. I love mixing music, and I love, I love just if I hear a song that plays and it's really nice. I, there's always another song in my mind. I mix and mash them in my head until the next live mixing, wherever I am. I will put them on order and see what they sounds like if they were sound like in my head. Yeah, yeah, that's good. What helps you when you write a mix? I think my emotions, uh, my love, my hate. Whatever is that emotion that I have at that moment, probably I've dumped my girlfriend or my son just ignores me. Oh. I don't know, whatever that emotion comes to me, it gives yeah. me that inspiration. And either I need to uplift the soul or I need to downlift the soul. So that inflects with music. But I always prefer to uplift because all my latest productions are always working on music where it's really high uplifting, you know, I want to keep them alive and yeah. BPMs are high, you know, because I do believe that music is controlling our lives. Yes. And um, it is very important. It's so important that we listen to good music that keeps us, you know, happy and alive. Well, music is emotions. Music is to do with emotions. And it? we do need our little downsides oh. and romances as well, of yeah. course, you know, there's so oh, many yeah. love songs I can sing. Yeah. How long does it take you on average to write a mix? Oh. Well, I can, to be honest, if you're talking about composing, it could, it could be done in a day oh, on, the, on, on the computers, you know? Yeah, but then, let's be honest, that, that no artwork does take a day, you know? Mm -hmm. I would yeah. say average, like we need a month or two, you know, breathing and breathing it out again. And sometimes we go in the studio with Ivan, we work on a song and then you wouldn't believe what it sounds like in the beginning and then what it sounds like in the end, you know? But then it's our emotions that puts us together there, you know, that we, that moment that we catch of our emotions that one of us has or whatever, we just squeeze that moment. And yeah, it can be done a day. That, 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 that sounds brilliant. I was going to say, that, 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 that's good, that, that way of doing it. And do you find writing mixes easy? Because I love this job. Because music is what made me who I am. Yes, I find it very
very easy, lovable, enjoying time. That's good. And have you ever done any live mixes before, such as the, you know, on the radio? Definitely, yeah. Actually, I have started DJing with the radio. And oh, fabulous. I, yes, it was, it was so interesting um, getting together, watching people on the radios. You know, it was very famous in my times, radios was. You know, not these days people are more, you know, on YouTube or anywhere they can grab music on and just yeah. listen, stick with what they do. But in my times, radios was very important. People was connecting there. And music, the, the, the best place to find music was the radios. And there was always a channel yes. for yes. Uh, people to listen and, you know. Yes, yeah, that's true. I mean, I, 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 st I still have the radio because I'm on the radio. Yeah, I mean, I think the radio is still a good thing. I mean, YouTube does help, but the radio is, is best. Do you get very nervous before going on stage to perform a live mix? Well, I, I, I do get every time I do get goosebumps because it depends on the crowd as well, yeah, of course. Of course. But yeah. um, I, I do play in uh, Tirana every weekend and yeah. every time in Tirana that I prepare, I get nervous as I am going to play 5,000 people, I would say. Oh, wow, but, I'm not surprised. But, but it, is, it is that feeling that I love. I look forward to that feeling, that yes. nervous or the excitement, whatever yeah. you can call it, but that vibe, you know, it's a challenge. Every weekend is a challenge. It is, it is, isn't it? It's, it's, it's the adrenaline, isn't it? Definitely. Yeah. And you have released your own musical mixes, haven't you? Yes. yes. Yeah. Finally, this year, I've done, yeah. I've done two, two extended players and about 13 wow. singles. That's amazing. That's amazing. I mean, yeah. I had really great help from Ivan. And you can, you can give me all the time. We've been together one year on the record label, Universal oh, Groups. Yes. Um, we've got together with so many great artists around the world and we've attracted great artists from Canada to oh, Italy. Wow. Yes, and we're still attracting more and we're trying to keep everyone independent and support them along the way. It was the idea of um, me having no support when I was a DJ and yeah. needing to have a backup like Universal Groups or Best DJ Agency. Yeah. And now we're making it available for DJs who would need that type of energy and support yeah. Yeah, well, that's through fun. internet, you know, whatever we can get our hands on. Yeah, so. And what advice would you give to someone first starting out in the music business? Ooh, well, I'll, I'll definitely, oh, this is a really great question, you know, but to be honest, um, the music industry is really sort of wild and massive industry. It is a change of life, I would say, so they need to yes. consider this very, very much. You know, criticism, yeah. judgmental actions, these will be everyday things that you'll be yeah. facing. And, uh, but then I do, I do think that if you choose music, you just choose it, don't you? Like, you have to go for yes. it. And, oh, yes. And, Music is endless, so. Oh, oh yes. This is so I met, I've met, I've met, I was in London and I met many musicians. I even met some people on the, you know, they, in the bazaars, they sit in the corners in the train stations or trams. They play guitars or anything, but they're musicians too. Yeah, Trust yeah. me, yeah. they do not moan what they do, they're still happy with what they do, you know. Yeah. In the music, I, I think you find love, you find the reality of life. Yes. It will show you, oh, and yes. everything is in there, you know, everything, yes. the good to the bad. Yes, yes, well, thank you very much, Ben. Yeah, thank, thank you, you very, very much, much. That has been very, very interesting. Amazing. You're <laughs> going to play my song now? Yes, I am. Yeah, Ben's song, Our Lives, is coming very shortly. Please stay tuned. Thank you very much.